my guy, Mario Esparza. Mario Esparza. I'm going to link his um, video, or not his video. I'm going to link the video, but I'm going to link his YouTube channel in here. But my guy, Mario Esparza, he's a street preacher and a pastor, I believe. My guy's out here doing work. Um, I watched I watched a little bit of his videos and I love what he does and all that. I love that, you know, the, what he brings to the table, how he presents the gospel. He walked up on these two right here, man. These two right here. I seen this video, I think it's it's like a minute long video. Man, with this type of mindset, you're not gonna get into the kingdom of heaven. With this type of mindset, you're not going to be saved. With this type of mindset, you're gonna go to hell, man. You're not going to make it because you are not even acknowledging the fact that you need a savior. And they, so listen to what they're about to say. This is crazy. And there's the, the crazy part is there's so many people that think like this. None of us are good. All right. None of us are holy for like by ourselves. None of us are righteous. We don't have our own righteousness. We are fil- our righteousness is filthy rags compared to God. Um, and we know that, but we know that we are in dire need for a savior because we know the evil that lives inside of us. These people don't, they don't seem to get that, bro. These type of people don't seem to get the fact that they are evil, they need a savior, and that the things they do are wrong and they will be judged by it. They don't, they don't see it. It's like they're blind to it until death gets close to them or they die, then they're going to see it. It's sad that it got to get to that, but Let's go ahead and watch this video. You guys are about to see what I'm talking about. This is ridiculous, bro. This type of mindset is crazy. Watch, watch how the video first starts. Here we go. It's not God's will for us to be straight. Shut the f- I'm ready to go. Okay. Huh. Listen, I believe he's God is trying to reach you guys both that he loves y'all. I know. And, but he's called y'all to, he says, be holy as I'm holy. We Jesus. We're going back to church. Y'all said y'all going back to church? Oh, we going to church. We're trying to find a good church, but you know. They trying to find a good church. I'm about to dissect this real quick. They want to find a good church. Okay. Everyone wants to go to a good church, right? We all want to go to a church that's good. Let's see what their definition of good is real quick. You know how it is these days with homosexuals. If they can't accept us how we are, then we don't want to be there. <laughs> Look at my guy's face. That's the same thing I'm feeling. Okay, so you want to go to a good church. All right, so their definition of good is those new age churches that allow them to indulge in whatever they want without any consequence, without any repercussions, without any conviction in the message. They don't want the conviction in the message. They want to go to a church that's going to accept them for their, the sin that they do. And they, they, they want the church to allow them to continue in a sin while giving them the message. Why? So they can feel good about themselves. Like I'm still getting, I'm going to heaven. My pastor said this. My pastor said this. My pastor said, it's okay to be homosexual. Jesus still loves you. Yeah, it's okay to, like, if you are in a carnal mindset, yeah, like, Jesus still loves you regardless, but guess what, bro? Like, it's a sin, and it's an abomination. Not only is it just a sin, it's an abomination. But people like this don't really, they, they want to find a church that, that's willing to accept their sin, man, and, and we can't think like that. That's the wrong mindset to be in. See, like you, you want your your way or the highway? That's what you're saying. No, but if I can't I be accepted as it, I am, because I'm a black not, woman. Oh no! Don't put the people. race in it. Oh yeah, because black woman. Talking, I got a bunch of black people if in my we're church. We're talking right. about religion. We're <laughs> going to talk about race because they're two of the same things. Yeah. And my church there's a lot of Mexicans. Either when oh. be accepted as I am, a black gay woman, then I'm not going to be there. Period. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. Just don't go to church then. Just continue on living your life. This is the, like these are the people where God says like if you give the message and they act like this, right? They deny it or they don't want to hear the message, then just wipe your feet, dust wipe, wipe the dust off your feet and keep it moving. Don't even try to fight for them because they not they're not even fighting for themselves. The right? They're fighting against you completely. These are the type of people. Unfortunately, and hopefully God will soften their heart someday. But I mean, from the looks of it, they already made their decision. Base too. Cause this Don't ain't got nothing to do with God. I was born black, but I'm still going through what but, I'm going through. But, no, okay. But you're the one who brought up the race. I didn't bring it up. Let's go. Look, wait, no, what? Can, 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 can I pray with you? Yeah. Thank you, Father. I thank you that. That's that's. It's a real quick video. That's the that's the uh video right there. Um, 
I wish there was more. Um, I'm glad that he at least prayed for one of them. I'm glad that like the one in the black shirt decided to receive some prayer. But like, I just wanted to post this video because I see so many people with this type of mindset that they want to do their sin, indulge in their sin. They want to live life how they want to live it. And they also want to get to heaven while, while doing all that, which seems crazy. You know what I'm saying? God is holy. God is righteous. We are not holy. We are not righteous by nature. We are sinful by nature. And so we have to change who we are to be more like Christ so that we can make it to heaven, right? But we can't think that, oh, we're just going to do what we want to do. We're going to live how we want to live. We're going to say and think how we want to think. And then God's going to accept us because of that, because he loves us. That's not how it is, right? God cannot, he, he can't let you into heaven, like stained up. That's why Jesus Christ came. But you can't not want to live like Christ, but then want to make it to heaven like Christ. It just don't work that way, man. Hey, man, look, if you're new to the channel, thank you for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss a video. Got more videos coming out for you guys. My name is Aaron Page. Appreciate y'all. I'll see y'all on the next video.